sub class 4.12 unforeseeable physical conditions in fidic 1999 edition this sub class provide the definition of physical conditions which means natural physical conditions man made physical conditions other physical obstructions pollutants subsurface hydrological conditions which the contractor may encounter at site excluding the climate conditions so if contractor faces adverse physical conditions which are unforeseeable the contractor shall provide notice to engineer as soon as possible the notice shall describe physical conditions and reasons why contractor considered them unforeseeable the contractor meanwhile continue execution of work shall take all appropriate measures for adverse physical conditions and comply with engineer's instructions these engineer instructions if constitute variation class 13 shall apply if contractors encounters unforeseeable physical conditions suffer delays and or incurs cost and give necessary notifications the contractor subject to sub class 20.1 shall be entitled to extension of time under sub class 8.4 and permit of any such cost excluding the profit since the reference of sub class 20.1 has been provided thereby meaning that contractor is required to provide another notice as required under sub class 20.1 so after necessary notification from the contractor what action is required to be uh, taken by the engineer first of all the engineer shall inspect and proceed with sub class 3.5 determination and if it was found that physical conditions were not foreseeable and contractor suffers delays and or cost the contractor shall be entitled extension of time and payment of any such cost but not profit well before finalizing the engineer may also review whether other physical conditions in similar parts of work were more favorable than at the time of bidding if yes the amount for advantageous physical condition would be deducted from the contract price the engineer may take into account of any evidence of physical conditions foreseen by the contractor at the time of submission of tender this evidence may be provided by the contractor however the engineer is not bound to accept such evidence this is one of the most important provision of the contract as it allocates the risk of physical conditions other than the bad weather between the contractor and the employer where these conditions are unforeseeable then the risk is borne by the employer and the contractor may be entitled to recover time and cost but not profit cost recoverable may be subject to deduction for advantageous physical conditions the definition of physical condition has a broad meaning such as natural man made and subsurface conditions although climate conditions are excluded the meaning of physical condition is however restricted to conditions on the site the site normally only includes those areas where permanent works are to be carried out and other places which may be specified in the contract areas where access roads or temporary storages uh, have to be constructed may not be included in the site and the contractor may have to take all risk of adverse physical conditions the exclusion of right to claim profit only applies where the unforeseeability was a result of nature of conditions themselves 
However, if it is the result of failure on the part of employer to provide data as required under subclass 4.10, contractor shall be entitled for profit as well. The engineer can take into account any evidence of what the contractor actually foresaw when submitting the tender. However, the engineer is not bound to accept such evidence.